This home is the most family-friendly home you'll ever see. If you've wanted to live in Henderson, this is the home for you. And I'll be sharing with you three reasons why this home is family-friendly. We are located at Club at Madera Canyon, which is a luxurious, gar-gated community. And this community is so quiet and peaceful because we're so far away from all the traffic and the commercial plazas. We are approximately 15 minutes away from the 15 freeway entrance off of St. Rose Parkway and Southern Highlands Parkway. And we're approximately 20 minutes away from the 215 freeway and the Eastern entrance. Reason number one, community amenities. In my opinion, this club at Madera Canyon has one of the greatest community amenities I've ever seen in any of the neighborhoods in Henderson, Nevada. Starting with the guard gate and the 24 seven roaming security. For every car that pulls up to the guard gate, the guard gate officer will check for the driver's license and also take a picture of your driver's license plate. They will also confirm that you're on the list or they will make a phone call to the property owner to ensure to give you access through the gates. Another thing I noticed, unlike other guard gated communities with a huge line of cars waiting to be checked in, this boutique community of Club Madera Canyon only features 546 homes. Therefore, the queue is much shorter, or for me right now, there was no line at all. I just rolled right in. This community features amenities like an outdoor swimming pool, tennis and pickleball courts, basketball courts, and even a fitness center. Kids could easily walk over to enjoy all these sporting amenities here. And because we're within the guard-gated community, parents don't have to worry too much. At the clubhouse, they have monthly events for all the families and kids in the neighborhood. They feature amazing events. I personally attended one. It was actually a Halloween event here, and they actually had trunk or treat, and all the parents were all dressed up, dressed up their cars, and were passing out candy. We actually went trick or treating in the community as well, and we spotted a lot of kids trick or treating in their electric bike or even a golf cart. How much is the homeowners association in a community like this one with so many amenities? Is it over $300 a month or is it under $300 a month? The answer is it's $298 per month to enjoy all these amenities. Before I take you inside, let me go over the specs of this beautiful home. Six bedrooms, including a casita, six bath, spanning 4,708 square feet on 9,600 square feet lot, three car garage with an expansive driveway, saltwater pool and spa, built-in barbecue, swings and trampoline, and even views of the strip and mountains. Let's go take a look inside. So the first thing I notice about this home that's really, really exceptional is this massive driveway. Not only do we have a three car garage, we have so much spaces for additional cars in the event you're entertaining friends and family. Another thing I notice is this super cute front porch. Let's go take a look. Great landscaping at the front, really nice, charming curb appeal. And then over here, we have a front porch. On a sunny day like this, can you picture yourself maybe enjoying a fresh cup of coffee or reading a book here on your front porch? Reason number two, this home features so many areas that are great for gatherings with your family. The first room to your right as you come through the front door is this bonus room. This bonus room is very spacious. Currently, it's been used as a kid's room or a craft room, but what would you make this room if you had an extra room? Another gathering space is this formal dining room. Take a look. Look at these high ceilings and look at this beautiful light fixture. In this space, you could really entertain and have a formal sit-down dinner. Take a look at this 13-foot kitchen counter, you guys. Wow, it's so exceptional, isn't it? Especially when you're cooking and you're entertaining, I could just picture the whole family gathering around this beautiful kitchen island, having conversations, eating, drinking, and this is a really nice family gathering spot. Right adjacent to the kitchen island is a cafe for casual dining. 
And then over here, we have the great room. In this great room, we have a very nice wood-burning gas fireplace. This is really nice and toasty, especially in the cold winter month. And this space is for gathering, especially after a long day of work, after a day of school. The family members could all gather together and have intimate conversations. Are you guys ready to see the casita? Follow me. So here we have a powder room, perfect for those that are entertaining outside and you need to use the restroom real quick. This is perfect. Behind me, we have the laundry room. And over here, we're gonna go through this covered outdoor dining patio area. So here is the casita, currently being used as a workspace and a gym. What do you guys think? Nice and open and spacious. And over here, you have an attached bathroom, a sink, a toilet, and a shower. Now I'm going to take you to the second floor and we're going to explore some of the gathering spaces up here. So to my right are two bedrooms. And over here we have a wonderful gathering space here upstairs, almost like a loft area where they've converted into a media room. So here you can watch your favorite Golden Knights game or play some video games. You have this really nice gathering space upstairs on the second floor. And to add to that, check out this patio. This patio is amazing. Come join me outside. So this is a really nice experience. Just outside that loft area on the second level, we're actually facing the front of the home. And from here, if you sit down here, you can really appreciate all the mountain views surrounding us. We're located on the south side of the Anthem, so we're really close to the mountains. And if you look over there, straight ahead, you have peekaboos of the Strip. Can you just picture yourself winding down after a long day with a glass of wine here and looking at the twinkling lights of the Strip? So follow me to the primary suite. I love the separation between the bedrooms because you have the two bedrooms here, but we're all the way back here tucked in for your primary suite, which has its own privacy. So we have French doors that open up. Look how large this bedroom space is. And then we also have a fire feature here. Very nice. TV. And let's go take a look at this incredible bathroom. I cannot wait to show it to you guys. This home has been meticulously designed for all its upgrades. And you guys, take a look at all of this. And what do you guys think? Comment below. We have a floating tub right here. We have two sinks. We have a vanity area here. And then you have this gorgeous shower system. I mean, take a look. I mean, what do you guys think? I really like that we have a separation in the two closets. We have his closet over here, and we have her closet over here. And you guessed it, her closet is much bigger than the his. By the way, if we haven't met yet, konnichiwa, my name is Kaori Nagao, your global real estate advisor, helping you find your new home. Whether it's a resale home like this one in Henderson, Nevada, or anywhere in the world, I'll be more than happy to help you with your home buying journey. Thank you so much for watching. I love it when you engage with me, so keep commenting below and let's keep going. Reason number three, this huge Mediterranean style backyard. Come walk with me. This is a dream backyard, you guys. First of all, we have an outdoor covered area for outdoor seating and entertainment. And remember, I was just at the casita. It's right off the casita. Over here, we have a trampoline system. For all of you that may know, my youngest daughter does gymnastics, so she loves flipping and bouncing all the time. So this is fantastic. This is a great place for all the kids to hang out and enjoy the trampoline. Behind me is the saltwater pool and spa. Now take a look, it's absolutely gorgeous. We have three water features there. And on top of that, we actually have this raised area and as you can see, this is the retaining wall. But what they did is they decided to dress it up. 
So you can see beautiful Italian cypresses all along here for the green and the privacy. And they've actually converted this upper area into a seating area. So come follow me. Let's go experience this upper level seating area. Wow, so cool. I could just picture myself hanging out here with maybe, um, you know, a pina colada or something frozen and just enjoying all the kids swimming and enjoying the summer month here in Henderson. In addition to the outdoor covered seating area over there, we have another covered seating area here, which is really nice for some relaxing time and conversations. And then over here, we have a built-in barbecue. This is amazing. Just picture yourself grilling on the summer month, or maybe it's July 4th weekend, you have friends and family over. This is a really nice setup when it's all built in. And on this side of the house, of the side yard, we have swings and a putting green. This is really, really amazing, especially for kids that just want different areas to hang out and enjoy themselves. What do you guys think? Isn't it amazing to have all these different kind of activities for the kids in your own backyard? So what did you all think about this family-friendly home? Which of my reasons is most important to you and why? Comment below, I'd love to hear from you. For more videos about Las Vegas and Henderson lifestyle, and to see more homes like this, make sure you check out one of the videos surrounding me. I really appreciate you watching. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for tuning in. It would really make me happy if you could like, subscribe, and smash that notification bell so you're made aware of my weekly content. Thank you so much, and I can't wait to see you on the next one.